let's talk about a very good deal out on the market and that is this little guy right here this is a nine millimeter handgun semi-automatic striker fired it's made by Taurus it's the PT 111 generation 2 and first off for those that are uh, keeping up with the current events you know Taurus has had some flack lately there's been some issues with their older models of handguns some of their handguns not all of them some of their handguns had some issues some safety issues and there was a uh, lawsuit settlement that came about uh, to keep things short to the point on that the generation 2 which is what this is isn't part of that there's no issues affecting the generation 2 models uh, it's a sound design everything's safe on it I in fact drop tested this a few times myself and um, I haven't been able to get the uh, firing pin to drop everything's pretty solid on it in my opinion I wouldn't hesitate to carry this at all this particular gun I picked up for 249 bucks you can find these for cheaper there are some deals out there you could find them for as cheap as 199 bucks uh, to me that is an awesome deal it's a um, striker fired nine millimeter double stack holds 12 in the magazine plus one in the pipe the gun is plus uh, plus P rated uh, me personally I don't shoot the plus P's I don't think there's really a need to standard pressure works just fine just select your ammo good even with nine millimeter I think the standard pressure is just great but uh, that's a whole other video topic right there uh, again $249 the same cost as you would see Keltex in my area <clears throat> so to me that puts it at a great deal it's a little bit smaller than a Glock 19 and just the design of the gun itself how it feels in hand is just wonderful again this is just a standard um, striker fired gun does have a frame mounted safety up is safe, down is fire. Standard controls take down as much like a Glock. So if you're familiar with how to take down a Glock, you'll be able to take this down no problem. Safeties on the trigger, much like uh, kind of standard fare for all the other striker fired or most of the other striker fired handguns out there. It does come with three dot sights. They are uh, plastic. The rear is adjustable. There is an aftermarket offering for night sights and such. So that's a good thing. Uh, external extractor. Very smooth in operation. Here is the 12 round magazine right here. Feeds very nice, very easy to operate. Low recoiling gun, it's very nice to shoot. I'll show you the trigger here. Right now, uh, the thing about Taurus is it has what's called, uh, a lot of people call them double strike capability. All that is, is when you load the gun, the gun's in single action mode. So there's your take up right to the sear. And there's the break and I'll show you the reset very nice reset for a budget gun this is excellent it's a very nice trigger now uh, if you want to fire the gun and it goes click instead of bang you can reset the trigger and pull again this is the double action mode Taurus is known for having these they had them on their older uh, generation of handguns and they have them on these as well so take it or leave it. Me personally, I don't do that. If the gun goes click instead of bang, I immediately uh, go into a tap rack bang and right back into it. That's just me. But it does have that feature. It does have a rail so you can fit your uh, compact size, lights, lasers, whatever you want to put on there. It does have a chamber loaded indicator on the top. Pokes out and shows red when you have a chamber, uh, when you have a round chambered. Slide serrations are very positive. You can see the slide serrations here, the design of the gun. Very, very compact, very snag free. The um, grips here, the factory stippling is very nice. I like the factory stippling that comes with it. It feels very good in hand. So I can't, uh, I can't not recommend this. It's a great shooting little gun. It's very budget price. I know a lot of people say, you know, friends don't let friends buy Taurus, but in my opinion uh, you should give this one a look if you're at the gun store and you see them go ahead and handle them they're very very ergonomic much better than the earlier generations so check it out and let me know what you think if you have this model and you have good or bad experiences feel free to leave it in the comment section below thank you